Hi everyone and welcome to a freezing cold Mauritius. Actually got down to 17 last night. I know, freezing. But it hasn't really warmed up that much. We're sitting at a 19 now. So I thought what I'll do is I'll do the Sam Young two times challenge. And if that doesn't warm me up, I don't think anything will. Let's open and see what we got. Okay, so we got some, some noodles and some packets of things. Sprinkling on top, this must be the chili. I think I might stuff this all back into the thing. Okay, so the water is boiling. Let's chuck this in. Get it all in. And apparently it's five minutes, so five minutes on the timer. Let's get that started. And today I'm using white chopsticks because I'm assuming this is all gonna be red. Because the packaging is red. So I won't be using the red chopsticks. I'll use the white chopsticks. They don't really say, but I think maybe stir it from time to time. So I've got my colander with the cup underneath. It does say I need about half a cup. Oh, that sounds like the alarm. So the alarm is off, this is ready. Let's just stop the alarm and get the noodles into the colander. Remember we do have the cup underneath, so I will pour it a little bit carefully because we do want to get back some of the water. It's an old pasta trick so that you can keep your, your pasta water. It's got all the, the starches still in it. That back on, shake that off. Oh, well, it looks like we got half a cup. And then add the half cup of water back in. Here's the moment of truth. We'll be adding the hot stuff in. Whoa, that looks quite gnarly. Try to get as much of it out as we can. Wow, it's really, really red. And they say mix it. Okay, so it does make quite a nice little red brew, and they say stir fry for another 30 seconds. So we'll get the stir fried for another 30 seconds. Final stir fry has been completed. Looking good, let's get it into the bowl. And there we go. Steamy and hot. Perfect for a winter's morning in Mauritius. Okay, this should be a good cover shot for the, the artwork. Before I get to eating them, apparently there's one more thing to add. I think it might just be decoration. Oh, it looks like cut up seaweed and sesame seeds. So that should be quite good. And that's how it looks in the end. For those that don't know, this can actually be opened up if you tear along the seams on the back and the front into what's called the two times bib. So, tuck that in, and it keeps you from splashing on your shirt. Top tip. I think we've waited long enough. Let's see if this is all it's cracked up to be. Am I gonna cry like a little girl? Or am I gonna think, well, they could have made this hotter. Let's see. We'll start with a nice big mouthful. And then if we die, well, cheers to that. Mm, mm. Not that hot. Oh, oh wait, oh, okay, okay, the heat is driving, oh, wow, Whew. the heat is driving, <laughs> Whew. okay, so the heat is starting to come through, uh, I've got quite a lot of it on my chopsticks, but yeah, I think I could do three times, where do we get three times? I think I've acclimatized. I've lived in Mauritius so long that two times has now become an edible snack for me. Uh, whereas before, before, I really thought I was gonna die. But I have made myself uh, a hot oil chili, which I think would increase the heat on this, so I'm probably not gonna add it. Who am I kidding? Of course we're gonna add it. This is the hot chili oil I made. Uh, it is very hot, trust me, it is not, not to be messed with. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Let me just put it under here so you can see this stuff is truly hot. So I'm just going to add one teaspoon to my Samyang three times. Put it down. Oh, it's actually staining the table, burning through the table. So for those of you who want to know how to make it, I'll put a card up. Uh, this side or that side 
there'll be an eye appearing somewhere here. You can click on that and it'll teach you how to make this hot oil. So I put a teaspoon in to see if it can match up to the Samyang. I mean, maybe it takes a little while to kick in. Mm. Mm. Oh. Next time you get your Samyang three times, make my hot oil, add two teaspoons into it. The flavor on that hot oil sauce is really nice. If you can take the heat, you've got to try it. Finally, a dish worth eating on a cold winter's day, the Mauritius. I'm not really crying. I'm just happy. <laughs> it really is hot. Okay, well, it looks like we're finally getting to the end. Not that much left. I think I'll just slip the rest out of the bowl. And I must admit, it has been getting hotter towards the bottom where all the liquidy bit is. I mean, there's not much liquid, but that stuff is hot. So I will slip this down. So I think that's conclusive proof that <coughs> it all went down. So when you use this as a bib, it's not really as a good thing to wipe your mouth. That was fantastic. People often ask me, what is one of the biggest problems about living on a tropical island? Well, on this tropical island in particular, it has no cows. Which means, whenever we want some milk, we have to get it from a packet. And because I don't really think these things through, I don't actually have any milk ready. And while I'm on fire, and I'm actually starting to sweat, my hair is wet. Yeah. I think I'll make some milk. So, the problems with tropical islands. If you didn't prepare yourself with some milk to drink, uh, you have to make it yourself. Next time you eat three times, just prepare your milk a little bit earlier. Once you've finished your two times Samyang noodle with extra hot oil, make yourself some milk. It only takes about 10 minutes and then it's ready to drink. Cheers everyone to Samyang. And remember, I think the round one is for subscribe, square one is for something else that you can watch. Samyang two times. Can't wait for the four times.